Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to another video where I'll be giving my thoughts on Bitcoin. Um, it's been a while since I've been on a vacation. Um, unfortunately, I came back and tested positive for COVID. So i um, sorry if my voice is a little different, but yeah, that's why. Um, but anyways, we'll keep grinding. Um, so I'll be giving my thoughts on Bitcoin here. Um, just quickly explain my game plans and what I'm looking to trade over the the coming week and weeks um all right so i'm gonna start off um on a clean chart here for bitcoin um and simply mark out some areas first so key area of resistance was obviously this one um why this was a sideways price section that led to the breakdown um the breakdown below 40k okay bounced nicely off of the demand that we've been talking about um, for ages from all the way back on top here. Um, we took some longs down here, uh, closed some up here, and then yeah, I was on vacation, so didn't quite trade a lot from there. Um, but anyways, we had clean highs up here, swept the highs locally into that area, um, that supply area that we discussed which is in my opinion a pretty bearish sign um that's a clear sign of distribution sideways price ex action try to break higher but fail sweep the highs instead into key resistance and drop so that's the main reason um that i'm mo mainly looking for shorts up here okay um, another big reason is we have this inefficiency down here which i think will get filled and um clean resting demand right here so this was the sideways price section sideways price section that led to this upside so this area should act um, at least for a while as support if we weak into it if we break below that area below here um, start seeing weakness then i think we'll be um heading a lot lower then i think this low is next into all of these clean lows sub 30k okay so this should be the the last defense for bulls if not um well bears will probably win and we'll get 30 sub 30k okay um so the game plan for now um so as i said mainly looking for shorts here um so let's zoom in a little we did just um, sweep overnight some lows here, so I could see some upside to sweep some highs next, okay? So what's my game plan? Was the supply that led to the dump? That's this area. So this was a sideways price section that led to the breakdown. So any sweep into that area and a rejection is a short, in my opinion, towards the area I just discussed, which is this demand okay so what is my game plan look for shorts on the sweep into this let's mark it in gray into this gray area let's see where ote is resting so if this is the low in for now the local low at least as you can see ote is resting up here um lining up with this key high so looking for shorts as close as possible towards to this area invalidation is above here and target down here so if i could get a short in um something like this invalidation up here target down here as you can see that's over 2r that's a beautiful trade high probability in my opinion clean invalidation also for bears it's easy to say if we break above this area that would show show us real strength and then i think we'll be heading for all of these highs into here okay so then this uh, id is invalidated that's the bullish scenario but as long as we stay below this ote block i think we'll be trading lower towards uh, sub 40k okay and then if this area holds we could start looking for longs on the sweeps something like this and then a sweep look for longs towards some highs and maybe even new highs um and if it doesn't hold well then in my opinion it's um 
it's much lower towards sub 30k okay so um i hope you enjoyed please leave a like on the video subscribe takes one second also a quick shout out to the sponsor of the video prime xbt you know the drill um they're a great exchange where you can trade all kinds of different assets um I'll leave a link in the description as well as a promo code you can use to get up to $7,000 in bonuses. Um, and yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.